Speaking of animals, we've all seen stories about April, the pregnant giraffe who has been pregnant and in labor for weeks. But not many people know about the baby giraffe. She is the newest addition to the Houston Zoo. And Channel 2's Chip Brewster joins us live from the zoo tonight to introduce us to this big little guy. Chip? Guys, I know everyone out there is hearing like, oh my gosh, brand new baby animal at the zoo. Let me see, let me see, let me see. So here, here's the story for you. Just absolutely beautiful. It's so cute. The newest giraffe at the Houston Zoo was born Monday morning just after nine. Measuring in at six foot three and 139 pounds, she was already quite the sight for those lucky enough to see her on her first day in the public enclosure. It's pretty large because it's born on Monday. Eventually, she will get those ossicones, those two protrusions off of her head, just like her mom. But right now, she has the little poofs that here we like to call them ossipoofs. They aren't, that's definitely not a technical term, but it's just a cute keeper term. Mary Fields is one of the keepers responsible for the giraffes and the zoo's breeding program. This baby's mom, Tyra, is part of the reason they've been so successful, having given birth to 10 babies so far at the Houston Zoo. In the past decade, about 40% of the giraffe population has gone down. Um, so there's that possibility that we could lose giraffes in the wild. So we want to make sure that we have a genetically viable population here in captivity. You may have noticed we haven't said the giraffe's name. That's because the zookeepers are still deciding what to call her. Perhaps they'll take six-year-old Andrew's suggestion into consideration. I think you should name it Bob. If you come out to the zoo right now, this is the only draft you're going to see in the enclosure. That is because baby and mom are out of the public eye. They are actually only appearing, for the most part, during the day, 9 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. Of course, that is barring any inclement weather or other mitigating issues. As for that name, they expect to have it out and decided in the next couple days. Live at the Houston Zoo, Chip Brewster, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right.